services and its characteristics. Services A business organization produces and offers goods and services in order to earn profit as well as to fulfill the needs and desires of consumers. Goods are tangible products that can be seen, touched and are capable of being delivered to a buyer. Services, on the other hand, are those intangible activities that provide satisfaction of wants and imply an interaction to be realized between the service provider and the consumer. For example, treatment by a doctor. Features of services Services have unique features which make them different from goods. The features which are known as the five eyes of services are intangibility, inconsistency, inseparability, inventory, less, and involvement. Let us understand the five eyes of services. Intangibility Services are intangible, that is, they cannot be seen, tasted, felt, heard or smelt before they are consumed like goods. They are experiential in nature. One cannot taste a doctor's treatment and can only experience it. Inconsistency the second important characteristic of services is inconsistency. The provision of services includes a large measure of human element. In this case, a service provider may alter its offer according to the needs of customers. For example, a doctor treats his patients according to their problems. Inseparability Another important characteristic of services is that the service provision is inseparable from the service consumption. For example, taxi operator drives taxi and the passenger uses it. The presence of the taxi driver is essential to provide the service. The services cannot be produced now for consumption at a later stage or time. Inventory Less Services are perishable and cannot be stored for future use. That is, service providers can store some associated goods, but not the service itself. For example, a railway ticket can be stored, but the railway journey will be experienced only when the railway provides it. Involvement The other important feature of services is the participation of the customer in the service delivery process. A customer may get modified services according to specific requirements. Services and goods can be distinguished on the following basis. Types of services Services can be classified into three broad categories. Business services, social services and personal services. Let us understand the different types of services in detail. Business Services Services which are used by business organizations in order to conduct their activities may be termed as business services. Examples of business services are banking, insurance, transportation, warehousing and communication services. Let's take a brief look at a few of these. Banking Banking is the business activity of accepting and safeguarding money owned by other individuals and entities and then lending out this money in order to earn profits. The different kinds of banks are commercial banks, cooperative banks, specialized banks and central banks. Insurance Insurance is a contract between two parties whereby one party agrees to undertake the risk of another in exchange for a consideration known as premium and promises to pay a fixed sum of money to the other party on the happening of an uncertain event or after the expiry of a certain period. Insurance may broadly be classified as life insurance and general insurance. 
Transportation Transportation includes freight services along with supporting and auxiliary services by all modes of transportation like rail, road, air and sea for the movement of goods and international carriage of passengers. Warehousing Warehousing is keeping and storing of goods in a scientific and systematic manner so as to maintain their original quality, value and usefulness. It is warehousing that makes the right commodity available in the right quantity at the right place in the right time in the right physical form at the right cost. There are different types of warehouses like private warehouses, public warehouses, bonded warehouses, government warehouses and cooperative warehouses. Communication Communication is a two-way process of reaching a mutual understanding in which participants not only exchange encode, decode, information but also create and share meaning. Business organizations need to communicate with suppliers, customers, competitors and so on in order to attain goals. The main communication services which help business can be classified into Postal and Telecom. Social Services Social services are those services that are generally provided voluntarily in pursuit of certain social goals like to improve the standard of living for weaker sections of society, to provide educational services to their children, or to provide health care and hygienic conditions in slum areas, just to name a few. Personal Services Those services which are experienced differently by different customers may be termed as personal services. These services depend upon the service provider, customers' preferences and demands. For example, Tourism Recreational Services Restaurants, just to name a few. In a nutshell, Services are those separately identifiable and essentially intangible activities that provide satisfaction of wants and are not necessarily linked to the sale of a product or another service. The five basic features of services that distinguish them from goods are intangibility, inconsistency, inseparability, inventory, less and involvement. Services can be broadly classified into three groups business services, social services and personal services.